Well, hey guys, we're on Cobham Drive with Veronica. She's the project uh, manager for uh, a great initiative, which is a shared path. Now, this is a stretch of road, Veronica, that you'd take if you were driving from the airport into the city in Wellington. Of course, just over there is that famous landmark, the Needle, yep. which is straight up in the air today because it's not that windy. Veronica, this is a great project, isn't it? Because you're taking into consideration people and the plants and animals that inhabit this area it's a shared path you've got cyclists on one way and pedestrians on the other it's great yes well what we're trying to encourage here it is to commute from the airport into the um, CBD um, this is a great route it's 1.6 kilometers we have a long a segregated pedestrian um, path and a two-way cycleway path around three meter wide most of the areas and you will have a lot of landscape Features here, you will have a lot of new developments and resting areas around the existing sculptures. Um, near the Calabar Runabout, you will have a lot more landscape features and a lot more viewing platforms for more enjoyment from people and the rest of the community. So it's not only about getting from A to B, it's maybe also stopping along the way and enjoying the area. And this separation of cyclists and pedestrians is, is quite a good safety feature as well. And of course, you were saying before that there's little blue penguins nesting along the coast. You've taken into consideration them and created housing for them. And you're also creating other platforms for wildlife, sea life to grow as well. And you've got a model for us that's a, a scale model. Yes, so this is the current prototype that we have. Um, after we complete the works, we will try to install these um, ecological tiles to encourage a lot more growth of the sea life and the new um, revetment work that we have done. Um, we also work with the little penguins. We have um, encouraged a lot more their habitat and increased that habitat for them to breed in these areas. Um, it is very well known that we have across the whole entire project uh, um, penguins nesting and molting through the whole entire year. It's, uh, it's great because it's not only considering the people that are going to be using this path but also the wildlife that was probably always here and so thinking about that. Hey thanks for um, joining us today and sharing your information on the shared path and hey, it's been a great week in the field trip hasn't it looking at modal shifts different types of transport getting people out of their cars and onto shared pathways like this there's so many different ways of getting around. What sort of things are you going to do at your place now that you've had an experience on the field trip like this? So many different ideas, so many opportunities. We'll see you on another field trip soon. Ka kite anō.